Kia ora koutou. E ngā mana e ngā reo e ngā iwi o te motu e huhi mai nei i tēnei pō. Tēnei aku mihi ki a koutou. Kia ora mai tātou katoa. It's a great pleasure to be here tonight with you all. I want to specifically acknowledge the Honourable Grant Robertson, Minister for Sport and Recreation, Carolyn Steele, the Chair of the Halberg Foundation, Shelley McKinnon, Chief Executive of the Halberg Foundation. As patron of the Halberg Foundation, I'm delighted to join you all here in celebrating New Zealand's sporting excellence this evening. These awards play a key role in enabling the remarkable work of the Halberg Foundation. Your presence at the awards demonstrates your support for the Foundation and its founder, Sir Murray Halberg. Sir Murray's legacy is not only an outstanding athlete, but also a true humanitarian. He remains an example to us all. I wish to take this opportunity to acknowledge the work of the Foundation in upholding the mana of children who might otherwise be excluded from activities that bring them joy and fulfilment. The Foundation also promotes better understanding of the challenges that are faced by disabled people and their whanau, and how inclusion and participation can transform the lives of disabled youths. I am immensely proud of our success at the Tokyo Paralympic Games, and I look forward to investing Safi Pasco later this year, someone who's been an inspiration to so many. I also note that there's another dame in the audience, or two or three. Lisa Carrington, I look forward to your investiture too. Congratulations to all the finalists and to the winners this evening. I know I'm not alone in my admiration for your poise, your skill, your humility, your gratitude and your commitment, and for the contribution that you have made to your sports. So without any further delay, I'm going to announce this year's Holberg Award goes to the winner of the Halberg Award is Dame Lisa Carrington. This is Dame Lisa's second Supreme Award following her win in 2016. Lisa's exploits on the water in Tokyo have further cemented her place as one of New Zealand's true sporting greats and inspirations to the next generation. Dame Lisa Carrington, your Halberg Supreme Award winner. Wow. Um, I think it's uh, incredibly uh, humbling to receive uh, this award, especially with so many amazing um, athletes, administrators, coaches um, that are here tonight and also around, uh, around New Zealand. Um, I guess it's really hard to, uh, I guess like everyone, we are so supported by so many from, you know, those who sit on the couch and watch us um, at home while we're competing in Tokyo to, you know, Gordy and uh, you know my partner Bucky and so I think one thing that drove us this year um, at the games um, as and my teammates uh, was Kotahitanga and I think um, it just spoke so truly to what we were there to do and that we were there to support each other because we couldn't we I couldn't have achieved what I did without them um, and vice versa so we were there for each other and so I think this award really is to all those that have supported me um, and I think it yeah so it's always really hard to thank those people so um, and it's always great to be here uh, to see everyone to acknowledge everyone for such an amazing uh, sporting uh, year so cool thank you very much <laughs> 